Okay guys, so I just quickly skipped to the battle. Uh, we were in at Karanjos, uh, we're heavily outnumbered, so I thought I'd skip out the loading screens to watch my slaughter go even quicker. But we have Boromir here, he better not die, otherwise I'm going to cry. Uh, quick plan is, we've got Fountain God, which will hold the gate. We're going to rush out our horses straight away and try to get them out so we can hammer an anvil straight away. So let's go. So let's quickly get him out as soon as we can. And already... Uh, the missiles are starting to hit. I should probably should have probably got my archers there shooting, but it doesn't really matter too much. Got my Gondor militia behind you as well. So yeah, it'd be easy to get out there quickly. If they get out quickly, then I can destroy them when they finally do get to the gate. Uh, let's move up the fountain guard. Stick them on guard as well. them there as well. So yeah, they lost a few men to archers, they lost two men to archers, it would seem, three men to archers, but now they're out and fine, so we can just run them away. And that should be absolutely fine, their archers are here. Yeah, they're not shooting at me anymore, which is good. So as you can see, our our towers are quite, cl you know, close at killing these. <laughs> I like, missed every single one. They've taken a few damages, damage away, which is fine. But they're going to do a lot of damage to me when we actually get in. How's the fountain guard? Are they mounted up? Yeah, the spears are. I think that person is fucking awesome. They're not going to break that in a while, especially on guard. They're going to be screwed. If only we had oil traps or something, that would absolutely destroy them. And they're starting to push a lot of men up there. Might have to pulp uh, his amazing ability. Yeah, they're throwing everyone up here. Just no one bothering to go for the gate. So I might throw my general into that. But then they'll hopefully get demolished by my men here. So yeah, let's fight them. And probably have to bring this unit up. Um, where's that general? Smash into there. Hopefully, it's only just coming up the gates now. I'm going to leave Boromir to fuck shit up. Uh, probably should bring up reinforcements. When I can click it properly. There you go. And he's coming in. He should hopefully at least delay the gate being broken. 54. He probably won't make it in time, but he should be able to kill most of the scouts. Um, which will be fine, hopefully. Oh no, they're getting ready <laughs> trying to get out of there so before my horses actually destroy them. Oh, what a sick charge. So yeah, the horses are now smashing that, which will hold them up, get them out though, because this bodyguard will absolutely destroy me, but we stop the... Come on, run, run. We stop them from at least battering down our gate for a few seconds, it means Archer Towers can do a bit more damage. And we're doing fine up there, which is lovely. Um, that's one unit, what's well, one good unit because these bodyguards don't die so at least we don't have them and the battering rams I think having to go all the way back, way back round so this unit should hopefully just get demolished um, missiles still going out which is lovely they're doing absolutely fine he can turn back around, I'm not quite sure where they're going now but it's fine, the towers are hitting them that's absolutely fine yeah obviously the reinforcements have come now and maybe they can just chase me all day long. I really do not care. Come on, they're just all dying. We need them to, to just die quicker. <laughs> really. I'm not even sure what they're doing. Let's charge them. I'm, I'm really unsure what they're doing, but let's just charge them anyway. When they decide to charge instead of just standing there. we go, charged it, okay, three, two, one, let's get out of there. Yep, yeah, we just about got out of there. We're down to 80 men now, which is nice. It's not many, we're starting to lose quite a few men up here as well. The Fountain Guard, which are our elite troops, are fine. Let's go smash into the back of these. I know there's some spears here, but as long as we just hit them quickly, then we should be fine. 
No, we can't. We're gonna have to Only back out. That's good. That's very good. We've managed to win this quite well, and they're just not even coming. <laughs> I guess because the gate hasn't been broken down, they're not coming, which is lovely. It's weird going like from playing Shogun and then coming to play this because I'm so used to units running automatically when I click, and it's just so much like so different. We'll charge and pretty much just go straight through. Borrow his other ability back here. There you go. Smash into them. Do a bit of damage and get them out in. Now we can stay there for a while actually. Clean these up very quickly actually. Okay, let's get them out in. Three, two, one. Come on, boys, get out of there. <laughs> this is my insane. Yeah, they've got no infantry left now. Bromir and that, and the boys have pretty completely cleaned that up. And let's just charge them into the hall, uh, into the archers to hopefully make these wrap them out because all their infantry is about to die. And we pretty much won that. I thought that was much easier than I thought it would have been because they have a lot more men. Just solely, I'm not even sure where they're going. <laughs> they're just taking the battering ram a long, long way away. Oh yeah, we have his horn down. No, we don't. He's still got that ability, which is fine. Yep, smash into them. They should get demolished. How close is their general to me? Have they turned the battering ram yet? No, they're taking the battering ram all the way out. Far, far away. Why is this? I'm curious. It's just a river. Archers can focus them down now. So yeah, all their infantry's dead now, which is lovely. Oh, some that orc thing broke. They've only got a few men left there, but they should die pretty easily. A nice volley from that should hurt them massively, which is good. So yeah, this is going well. <laughs> then I can obviously get then get reinforcements here, reinforce it. Um, get some marines up here probably <laughs> yeah you get one volley off one more volley off and I'll get them back on them because obviously these people have a much higher armor rating <laughs> I'm still not I'm really unsure um, what them horses are doing actually where's the fountain guard here we are they can just charge out and wipe them out very quickly. Bodyguard's gonna quickly clean up these men. We will just glitch out and then hopefully stop any of these from coming back. Fountain Guard are gonna absolutely just demolish this unit of archers. There's literally nothing they can do to stop them. I'll probably take more friendly fire than anything else. Oh, have they hit into some routing swords as well? No. This is just all broken. Just might, might as well route it all down. And they're still not moving, which is fine. So yeah, this has been a very successful battle. I mean, we have to still have to deal with a general. And we have to still have to deal with this. But it's not deciding to come around, so I'm not going to complain at all. And yeah, they routed. Fountain Guard can go back in the city. He can just continue to clean up all of these. Got nothing, and we can fast forward it then. And our archers can continue just to shoot away. So yeah, this is pretty much one. Um, I'm probably gonna end up. I'm gonna pause it now. Um, well, I'm not gonna pause it. I'm just gonna stop recording because this could go on for a long while. We might have to wait for the timer to run out or something. So whilst um, there he is. I knew they weren't getting away, so whilst this does that, I shall uh, yeah, stop recording until it gets to some action, and then I will start recording again when we get back into action, okay? So yeah, see you guys in a little bit, or in a second, or now. Okay guys, so I decided to go out and uh, meet them, because they glitched out on the ram, so now we're just going to take quite a few volleys from behind um, of my missiles. 
and I'm just gonna chill because the reinforcements aren't coming. It's solely just this, but no matter what, if they wouldn't have, um, like even if they had the reinforcements here, I would be able to hold it because Borom is a badass and he wouldn't have died. So that would have been fine, either way. Just lowering my numbers quickly before we engage them. And they're cleverly going for my weakest troops first, but come on, one more volley before they get close. We kill anyone? Probably took away a few hit points, though. That is absolutely fine. Charge that. Actually, let's get him right from behind. And let's get Boromir from the side. And they'll be completely screwed. I mean, if uh, um, they broke through now over here, I'd have about have about 20 men to hold it. I mean, I've got these nine up here, but they would just get destroyed so quickly. Blow my horn, but I'm not gonna do it myself because Diplex will just make fun of me again. So um, probably best not to blow my horn in IRL. Yeah, apparently defeat seems almost certain, but personally, I think it seems pretty. Um, pretty in our favour. I mean if we do that, that looks pretty nice. And they're pretty screwed, they can push onto our pikes and um, have been absolutely destroyed from behind so they're routing now. They'll be cleaned up. Yep. Our men have captured oh, the slice through the back, that was nice. Well so we can see us the rest oh, we captured army. him, nice. That was good. So yeah, I'm just gonna. I don't know. Should we go out and kill the army out here? Yeah, let's go. We'll probably lose it now, but let's go nonetheless. We make a walk, and um, you know, if I run out of time, it's, we win either way. But you might as well destroy these now because I'll have to fight them again um, soon enough. I'm not gonna make it in time. So anyway, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop recording again and wait till I at least get closer for it to happen okay so uh, see you guys um, right now okay so the AI decided to send one unit at a time it would seem that we finally got round here so yeah let's go ahead and destroy this unit let's hope we can get to it before we get to our archers here we go we'll get some mounting guard we'll get some guard uh, some mounting guard not mounting guard some mounting guard in from the side and we got our other general guy out here bring him up a little bit um, get them to stop shooting as well because we don't want to cause any friendly fire blow the horn as well where are the archers? the archers are here so let's get energy oh, oh nice that was lovely they should route quite quickly ok I just skip forward a little bit because we finally got here and um, yeah we killed the general now we're just fighting them hopefully we should destroy them archers shooting on them so yeah we should hopefully do quite a bit of damage with our archers and then obviously the lads up here should clean this army up we kill their general keep, keep on blowing that horn but not an iron around so yeah we'll get some nice action of them fighting we'll just get him smashed by the fountain guard literally Boromir is struggling up here a little bit though. He's a bit isolated, it would seem. If they just want, we might as well just stick on flames. Because obviously they, they like getting peppered with archer fire. <laughs> Seems to be there. Well, I just say, just seem to like it really. And we got our general to, over here, ready to strike when the time comes but if we if it, this all fails and we still have our brave nine men back here getting ready to hold the line <laughs> uh, but yeah these must route soon enough and yeah there Hope for, come on are you gonna volley now or are you gonna make me look stupid I'll just zoomed in there we go and now hit them with the fire arrows it's gonna be doing quite a bit of damage which is lovely. The archers have now come Oh wait, to hit my general now, are they in range? They're trying to get in range, so let's just bring him out. Don't want him to die at all. They routed, lovely. So now let's charge them. 
but let's use Boromir as a flanking force. Horses got out of the way, which is fine. So these two will fight them. And then Boromir shall hit them from behind, because Boromir likes to take the enemy from behind. Oh, sick impact! <laughs> and that man just died straight away. Oh. What are they doing? They're just there in such a bad fighting position. All completely surround these. Um, my cat's trying to get into my drawer and sneezing at the same time, which is kind of weird. Oh, they're starting to bring up some archers now. Let's go entice them with this general. We'll go archer off with their archers. They'll win. And we'll get Boromir to come in from behind. <laughs> I've said that Boromir's coming in from behind so many times. Come on, no, we, want, we don't want to get involved. Do we? It'll be like Faramir. The Archer Militia are coming. No, we don't wanna don't wanna sacrifice them. But yeah, this battle is basically won. I failed to see how we're going to lose it. Charge into them, archers are almost up to start duelling away. Let's send them in, let's send them in like Faramir. Seems to be swinging in our favor. Yeah, I'd hope but it would be. Oh, look at them. Just if only it had the cool music playing like, you know, in, um, in the third age. That'd be awesome. Well, maybe I do. Maybe I'm, my editing skills are that sick that I stuck it in. I doubt it, but, you know, you might get a nice treat. Charge! Yeah. Got our archers firing away at them as well. Causing havoc. They should rout hopefully soon, they're already shaken. They should rout very soon, let's just, just smash these from behind. <laughs> Keep on saying from behind so much, it just makes me giggle every time. But yeah, the fire arrows are extremely deadly. Look, deadly, look at that. So many of them dead. It's just a matter of time to wave out. No, I just got my horses taking up the stragglers. And that dude has killed a lot of people with battle. These orcs are there. Freaking. Oh, we've run out of missiles now. So let's get these here. And they can smash these uh, orcs from behind. I should hopefully route them. But yeah, we, <laughs> these fountain guards have done a lot of damage as well. Can't wait till I get like an entire army of fountain guards. Yeah, they just hopefully they just keep on doing from behind. They don't all turn. And I can just kill a man, each man. Like, do a lot of damage. Oh, it's like they've routed them. Yeah, they routed him and completely pushed up against the wall and destroyed. And apparently there's still another unit. Over here somewhere. Is it just routing? Hopefully it's routing, yeah. It's getting the fuck out of there. So yeah, we completely annihilated them. Why aren't they charging? Charge! That's just like a juicy volley. That would have hurt. Come on, just rout them already. These horses have killed so many. They all got fucking three chevrons. I know they 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 don't have more chevrons because there's not as many of them left. But still, um, we'll just get these horses to take them down quickly. Get rid of the entire unit quick enough. But yeah, all our infantry should kill it quickly. And then we can end the battle once they're all dead. If they're all dead. Yeah, we've seen so. And there. Oh no, there's still someone left. I just don't want the unit because they'll retrain it like automatically because the AI cheats. So we just want to get rid of that very, very soon. And just make sure we kill each individual unit 
but yeah, there's no way that, that person's getting the away. There you go. Utterly vanquished. Oh, we killed a lot of men. We killed twelve hundred men. Let's see um, who got who got most kills. Citadel Guard, which is Boromir, I believe, got two hundred and sixty. <laughs> Our militia over here got two hundred and twenty-five. This general got two hundred and eighteen, and he was alone. He only had like eighteen men to start off with. So yeah, he destroyed. He destroyed everything. So I just got a text. I'm so freaking popular. Just replying to that quickly. There is no glory in hiding like this, my lord. Oh my god, we can ransom that for a lot of money. And they rejected it. So either way, I don't lose any honor, and they will die. So. It's not bad, they're gonna come and attack Ozilia East. Um, so yeah, we should be able to hold back, they'll besiege it, probably take them a turn to actually come. By then I can obviously reinforce Kandros and uh, reinforce um, the, um, both West and East of Zillia and hold that nicely. So yeah, I'll probably end the episode, I probably won't play any turns, just end the episode now. And obviously we can bring the Axemen up, which will be extremely nice and juicy at holding Calandros. Um, yeah, you can marry, marry the fuck out of that person. Yeah, their army routed, I've set them a besiege. Oh, production we now won as well, that's nice. Most advanced faction. Mission successful. Oh, we have two units of militia. We were going straight to Kyandros. We can go no further today. Can we retrain anyone? Ninety three, yeah, we'll retrain them. Um so yeah then we'll have loads of men at Kyandros now. Which will be nice. Uh what else can we build here? Put another unit of militia, which is nice. We've already got two units of marines there as well. That should be able to hold off against what equal numbers, you. we should be fine. If not, we still got um West of Zillif to hold. Uh, to still hold even. Um, uh, you should be. Let's do that and then let's spend the rest of our money on buildings, strategic buildings, which will help us uh, with money. Land clearance. Oh no, we don't want to do that. So we could lose it and it'd be a complete waste of money. Roads built there. Market. Market. Should we get a market? We'll get a land clearance, definitely. Do we have enough for a market? Um, how much was the market? Because I can always uh, stop a production of uh, that bow unit or militia unit so I can get it. 1300. I'm not going to get rid of both of them, I'm going to try to get rid of one. Um, no, rare enough. No, we won't, so we might as well just do that. Um, we still have 700 to then carry on to the next turn. Uh, they're getting closer as closer. Obviously, we'll spend that bow unit. Actually, no, we need bows up here, don't we? Yeah, we do. Okay, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode now. Um, I just thought I'd bring you that juicy battle of Boromir owning up some scrubs, um, which he did and did well. He's got quite a few kills to his name now. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, please do go ahead and click that subscribe button. It means a lot. Helps out my channel. If you just go share a friend or something, or you want to post it somewhere or anything, it really helps out my channel. Um, my channel has grown massively since 3.0 came out, which is which has been awesome. So uh, yeah, big thank you to you guys, you guys for watching and uh, keeping on watching. It means a lot. So yeah, for sure. And thank you. Pooh.